tonight, Branch Aunt Burlington is speaking out after a decades-old tree is unceremoniously removed. WPTZ's Hannah McDonald was there when the big cottonwood came down. Oh my God! Ann Taylor wanted nothing more than for this nearly century-old tree to stay put. I'm very disappointed. I'm on the verge of tears. On her way to work Wednesday, she saw the cottonwood coming down, the tree she chained herself to just two weeks earlier. We're in a real tight spot. In October, Jesse Bridges of Burlington's Parks and Recreation Department said the tree interfered with plans for the city's bike path expansion project. The tree came down piece by piece, some parts of it weighing over 4,000 pounds. It, you know, the angst for me is simply that. Human, it's not simply, it's something we live with all the time, which is that the human being gets out its chainsaws, its bulldozers, and its dynamite, and when something's in the way, we just blow it up. Supporters have suggested a number of alternatives, including rerouting the path or putting in ramps or platforms over the roots, but Taylor says those ideas were never given a chance. There was not a crack and not an opening and not a softening of the attitude that this 80-year-old cottonwood tree has to come down. The first phase of the bike path project is expected to continue into the spring. In Burlington, Hannah McDonald, WPTZ, News Channel 5.